guys welcome to my channel if you don't subscribe my channel please subscribe and click the bell icon so today I'm going to tell you how to get a good clan very very good clan so if you're joining a clan the first thing you're going to do Sorry, in this video, I'm going to tell a lot of things. I mean, a lot of things. I don't even know about it. I don't even know about it. So, first thing I'm going to tell is how to join any good clan. So, well donating clan, I mean, yeah. So, everyone who search for a clan will first get for the, yes, description. I have to uh, love this low man shando this clan's name active members are welcomed welcome to our clan so there's no donating description here we are hundo boys we can do everything not that not that Yeah, here it is. So look the description of this clan. The respect your leader and acknowledge his power. That's the first one. Second, your donation should not be zero, especially if you are a higher rank member. So that doesn't matter. Everyone who make every clans, every clans, right like this. But uh, you know. Other outsiders join these clans and they well know that there are some clans like this okay there will be so many members in these clans but after 10 seconds one will leave then after 10 seconds one will come then after 10 seconds one will leave like that clans um, we don't like it you know no no one will like it so today I'm going to tell you how does this thing happens okay let me look okay if you join any clan take a any friendship of take a bigger friendship of uh, someone like higher leagues than you look i made friendship with um royal harsh then damn to costa i think so yeah then this guy you know arnold yeah i am in big friendship with him and he always gave me top level four dragon man yeah level four dragon yeah, that's pretty awesome. Okay, the first thing about this video is almost over now. So, I'm going to get into the second thing. How to get your base max out. So, first, uh, if you upgrade your town hall, yeah. If your town hall is upgraded, um, you will get some, you know, you will get some boost for your army and uh, for your treasury yes that will be a four in your bonus loop right so make that bonus loot four into bonus loot that's mega amazing so take every loot into your treasury don't collect neither one of them don't collect it make your treasury full first that is the first thing you need to do the second thing you need to upgrade your spell factory your barracks and uh, laboratory if you upgrade your laboratory um, from the boost you get from the town upgraded town hall will automatically 
high up your army's level so you just need to upgrade your laboratory okay understood but after this the boost will be over mm, that's a big problem right yeah so that much things you need to do but after that after the boost is over you just need to do is uh, you want to be the treasury full and your spell factories want to upgrade it yeah spell factory where is that yeah spell factory want to upgrade it uh, your spell factory want to be upgraded and uh, your laboratory so the next thing is slowly 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 upgrade your defenses like from lower upgrades to bigger upgrades like this you know when i upgraded my townhouse to level six i was afraid man to upgrade the motor i need to give away four lakhs and to upgrade my uh you know from townhouse five i upgraded my visa tower for three lakh sixty thousand so that was not amazing you know that's a low cost for me not that much very good low cost so when i get to uh townhouse six i was amazed to see this thing you know seven lakhs to upgrade to three but you know just plus three damage plus two damage per second just plus three that's not actually very very good um yes so i want to tell you one more thing uh the first thing i said clans about clans you know always check their clan wars if they are good very very good very attack you you know every uh clan wish that everyone should be online okay so yeah i was telling about yeah i was telling about oh no i remember i don't remember oh um yeah yeah i uh, know no yeah upgrades defensive upgrades so you just want to slowly upgrade your defensive buildings you know um everything is just costly if you upgrade your town hall and look for your defenses to upgrade much coster you know in the next level that is town hall 7 for me 7 lakh 20000 to upgrade to level 8 that is awesome man oh i'm just thinking how could i do that i don't just even maxed out these things oh yeah now you well know that how to upgrade these things yeah after upgrading these um defensive buildings you just need to upgrade slowly slowly very slowly calmly upgrade your walls walls yeah walls but don't use any any of these things you know any of this treasury but you will use it before how you know first thing i said was clans that's over now the second thing is how to be the maxed out base of your town hall first thing is uh, slow first thing i want to make a change that is first you attack man you attack attack everyone get your star bonus loots and make your treasury full so after that you will learn not learn after that you will get a lot of elixirs and gold use every elixir and upgrade these things well factory yeah for me it's uh, it like laboratory 
And next to this, ballots. Upgrade this with your treasury loot bonus elixirs. Then save the coins. Next you need to do with these uh, star bonus loot coins. You want to upgrade your defenses slowly. After upgrading your defenses with uh, your attack loot, you want to upgrade your walls very very slowly okay so this is the thing i was going to tell so that's almost over the next thing i need to say um is how to attack a town hall fraud from town hall six but very successful very very successful okay um, maybe with CC troops or no CC troops. I think I need some of these CC troops. But where do I get this? Uh, I'm an online. Only two online. Me and someone. Who's that? Uh, I don't know. Don't know. So what do I need to do? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now I know. Yeah, you just need to do this thing. That is. You Im just get your army upgraded. Laboratory upgrade. Yo, I'm just telling the things about um, Town Hall 6, okay? Only Town Hall 6. Okay? Yeah. Um, just if after upgrading your laboratory you just need to upgrade all of these things i mean your troops with elixir uh, somehow you will get elixir right yeah then you just need to upgrade your elixir collectors man and the gold mines of course so yeah after that upgrade your army upgrade your lab uh, army camps oh that need a lot of Lot of effort of elixir. Okay, um, what I'm speaking of? Yeah, yeah, now I know. Um, yeah, yeah. Upgrade your lab troops in the laboratory and get your troops ready. So, but first, make a group. So, this is my army four. This is my army list. So, and my town has six army line uh i did level three wizards that is eight eight wizards that is level three and 12 giants that is level three 15 archers that is level three two healers that's level one two heal spells that is level two that's it that cost sixty five thousand five hundred sixty elixir Time 42 minutes. No, that's the cost, not actually 65,560. Real time is, you know, there's an offer for wizards cost. Mm, now it is 720 elixir. No, first it was something like 72,000, yeah. 72,950, yeah, like that something. Now, you now know from this just take eight wizards that is level three just take 12 giants that is level three just take uh, 15 archers that is level three two healers that is level one two heal spells that is level two now before that you need to upgrade your army camp to 135 yeah 135 then only you will you can make it to this now you know this right okay then train it okay train 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 okay guys now my troops are upgraded now let's attack at town hall 5 that will Get mega loot. 
mega loot. Uh, almost up to one lakh fifty thousand elixir and gold. Uh, sometimes it may be one lakh. Don't know. It's okay. Don't attack Town Hall Sevens, especially. I tell that. Don't attack. And don't even attack Town Hall Sixes also. But if if you see any noob Town Hall Six, very very noob, and you have more loot, you can attack that Town Hall Six. And if you see a Town Hall Five, and it has lots of loot, but it's noob, uh, kind of noob. But if it's get like 20 plus, yeah, you see, 20 plus trophies. If you get like that, don't attack it, man. Something is there in its CC. There will be CC troops, so don't attack. Just get for good bases. Not good bases. Uh, can have five noob. Yeah, just need that. Where is it? Where is it? No, I'm not getting any town hall five, man. Not getting any of them. How do I get? It? Yeah, got it. No, no, this is town hall six, man. Oh. Yeah, I gained town hall six. I gained town hall six. Ah, oh. I'm exhausted. How do I do this? How do? I do this. Somebody knows how do I do this? I don't even know. Haha. <laughs> seven. Yeah, I said don't attack the at town house seven, okay. Don't attack them. No, wizard tower. Yeah. Now I'm coming to the fourth thing of attacking at town house five. Just if you're attacking with these 12 giants, you want to first attack and defeat this wizard tower. If the wizard tower is inner of this base, you can attack him because uh, wizard tower deals a lot of aerial splash damage. That will be that will cost you. I mean, that will. Make your every giant's bang. Bang means mega bang. Hmm. I'm searching so many times. Where do I get it? Oh. Okay, guys. Now I got a base. Town have five base. So, um, I'm very exhausted, man. Okay, very, very exhausted. Just 72,000 and 78,000 elixir and gold. No, just attacking, man. Attacking business. Okay. After so many searching, I just done it. Only because of... I'm exhausted. So, first, deploy your 12 giants. And get the heal spell of this wizard. And uh, wizards from backside. Wizards, yeah. Now, wizard tower is gone. You just need to do is from here. You just deal so much. Yes, this is the moment I've been waiting for. I will deploy the healers for the giants so that. Yeah, go, man. Go, go, go. Oh, no. What the healer is doing there? Yeah, go. Yes, 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 yes. Healer, healer. Yeah. From the side. From the side, these um, wizards will clean, help for cleanup, and from sides. These 
defenses will be destroyed too. So this is the attack, attack strategy. After, de after destroying the air defense, you just need to deploy your healers to heal your giants. Giants are very important for cleaning up these uh, cleaning up defenses. Yeah, if you make loons, if you you would think that we could use loons to clean up these defenses, but beware of air defenses. Air defenses are very very um you know very very attacky to loons and that's the thing. Okay, that is that's it. That's a three star victory from a town half five. So this is the video that I've I've been waiting for. Please subscribe my channel if you didn't subscribe it. Yeah. I need to just train it. Train, train, train. So bye guys. Bye bye. Not. Don't forget to subscribe my channel. Bye bye guys.